Hi, favored ones. Welcome to Soul Reflections. In today's session, I'd like to talk about creating order for a more peaceful life. Because <laughs> this week, I've been going, I've been doing some PIR-related matters and really need three days to teach it. Um, when I say three days, it's with the documents to organize it. Going to the IR, going to the banks, um, payments, and even the waiting time. Ito na rin. Or makikipag-usap ka sa mga revenue officers. Kasama. But you know, at the end of that uh, three-day errand, the IR, I was able to finish um, my transaction. And now, I still... And you know... It, realize na, oo, oh, nakakapagod siya. Kasi you know, fix all the... Um, then, you know, even if it was physically tiring and exhausting, I feel at peace because everything right now is orderly. So, maayos na ulit. So, maayos na yun. Um, wala na akong parang backlog. There's no issues anymore. So, it realize um it may be the things that they so there's there's the fact of um kasi lahat sabay sabay but you know it really pinpoint the importance of having order in time and it's not just with the past the activities that we're so but also in our relationships and all other aspects of want or uh, so as much as possible the only thing that we can is ourselves so from our end internally we create order for for our lives um just hanggang saan yung kaya plus external hindi naman talaga kaya di ba and um but it also made me think no? kasi syempre right now there's the war in Green and Russia, the mind and there's tension in the world. Tapos yung stock market patin from sak. <laughs> and it made me think of chaos. But you know, when I look at it from an observer, if I look at it from a bigger perspective, there is also order chaos. And of course, it's always sad when people would harm or suffer then so bigger point still for because naturally world chaotic world naturally then it all comes in order then it will fix itself it will resolve on its own, ano man yung. So it made me realize that order is very important. And even in, it's also over there, the order of things. On this order. And you know, environment. What's, but what's more important is find that inner peace that despite the noise the go around us always have that inner peace and are able our natural state their natural state is happy peaceful just still joy and that's the no, that's the reflection for, for this week. Um I know it seems like it's still all over the place because I haven't written it yet in the journal, in my journal. And it's only now that I, I've been thinking about earlier this morning. And the thoughts are still there. Um of course now that I'm talking about it, I try to make it as structured as possible so that um but then 
my my takeaway from this week's activities is that order is so important. Feel that the world is ordered very you can always create order within your software. And still at within within the chaotic world, because that chaotic world is still there's still a natural order of things. And eventually things will solve or fix itself. Um, so have faith. Always have faith that everything all shall be well. Okay, it's having Juliet of Juliet of Orwich. Right? So God bless everyone. Um happy Sunday. And of course, um my next soul talk guest is Trisha Huang. Um, brilliant, brilliant, um, uh, brilliant. I don't call her girl because she's so mature. Niya talaga magsep. But she was my student last term and brilliant. Um, very mature. In, um, she speaks in a very soft, simple lang sa salita. Pero the oh that her mind is really, really mature. I can call her as well. So, um, watch her episode. So, oh, it's coming Tuesday, 6 p.m. That's Trisha. Um, she's a double, ano siya, double, uh, double degree student. So, she's taking up accountancy and um, enjoy that. Okay, so, for those who need to talk for counseling or into the readings, send me a message. Um, you can always set an appointment. Right? So, God bless everyone.